Russia and China continue their joint naval military exercise in the Sea of Okhotsk. The joint Russian-Chinese naval exercise Bibu slash Interaction 2024 began Saturday in the Sea of Japan and included anti-aircraft and anti-submarine operations. A joint detachment of warships from the Pacific Fleet and the Chinese Navy practiced maneuvering, building a marching order, air defense tasks, and the protection and defense of the detachment while moored in an unprotected roadstead, the Russian Defense Ministry said in a statement. Russian large anti-submarine destroyers Admiral Pantelyev and Admiral Tribets as well as Corvettes MPK-82 and MPK-107 were among the warships taking part in the drills, Interfax reported. China was represented by the destroyers Xining and Wuxi, the frigate Lini, and the integrated supply ship Taihu, the agency added. A U.S. Navy replenishment ship operating in the Middle East sustained damage in an incident which is under investigation, officials said Tuesday. The damage to the USNS Bighorn comes after the oiler has supplied the USS Abraham Lincoln aircraft carrier strike group and remains in the region amid heightened tensions over the Israel-Hamas war and Israel's ongoing strikes targeting Hezbollah in Lebanon. A U.S. Navy official, speaking on condition of anonymity to discuss matters yet to be made public, said the damage happened in the Mideast, but declined to elaborate on its location. A photo released by the U.S. military dated September 5 showed sailors aboard the Lincoln receiving supplies from the Big Horn, while another on September 11 showed the Big Horn alongside the Lincoln. The Lincoln is patrolling the Arabian Sea. The official said the Big Horn's crew was safe and there was no sign of an oil leak from the vessel. Another U.S. official, who spoke on condition of anonymity for the same reason, said the vessel was being supported by private tugboats and an assessment was still ongoing for the vessel. Rumors about the Big Horn's condition began circulating early Tuesday after images posted to a website tracking shipping called G-Captain showed flooding purportedly on board the Henry J. Kaiser-class fleet replenishment oiler. The website described the Big Horn as having ran aground and partially flooded off the coast of Oman. Though the Lincoln is powered by a nuclear reactor, its strike group has vessels powered by fossil fuel that need to be resupplied at sea. The aircraft aboard the Lincoln also need jet fuel. The Big Horn and other ships like it also provide other supplies. <laughs> 